Hi. What's up? Hello again. <laughs> Everybody here. Yeah, I don't know if this is a good idea because there's a lot of people. Here. I'm not gonna do this while I'm driving. We're at Oyster Bay, New York, currently <laughs> to do some stuff. Uh, what did you dream about last night? Um, I had no dreams last night. I don't dream. What are we doing? Steel wool photography. That's really, what it's called? What is it? Steel wool photography. So, in case you don't know what steel wool photography is, essentially all you need is a camera preferably a DSLR, and a tripod. What this is actually is a long exposure shot. You've definitely seen it online with the uh, spinning sparkles. It's steel wool that's lit on fire and it creates sparks, so when you make it a long exposure shot, it looks like it's all mixed together. It's really dope. We're gonna make our attempt at it now. I appreciate your whole lighting setup, by the way. <laughs> that's that's really nice of you. That's, a, that's an iPhone on a GPS mount. Okay, let's go. Start thinking about this is the spot right here. Ah, too much light. Too much light. Uh, okay. So what you really want is a nice, beautiful setting that's low lit, so that when it is lit with sparks, it's pretty. I'm pretending like I know what I'm talking about. Okay, enough shining light in my face. Oh, I don't know. I also neglected to mention that you also should have a dog leash or some type of rope instrument. And you would need some type of carrier for the uh, steel wool. In this case, we're using a, what is this called? A whisk. A whisk for like churning eggs and batter and whatnot. This is the steel wool in question. This you pack into this and uh, you light it on fire and this is what comes from it. All of the stuff is just for precaution, like what, like the glove and the glo goggles. Oh, the, all that safety stuff. Yeah. No, you don't need that. Safety, safety last. <laughs> okay, so we have the said tripod and camera fixed here. Now I just need to get focus on him. Now I want to set my shutter to a higher number, so I'll set it for 15 in this case. Aperture, they say, to keep it at eight. ISO you want to keep between 100 to 200. I would do 200. I think that should be good. Oh shit, I messed it up. Hold on, hold on. I kicked the tripod, I'm sorry. Um, here. So you're putting the steel wool inside of the whisk and the whisk will be attached to the rope slash dog leash that you're gonna spin. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you're ready. You're so ready right now. Oh yeah, we mean business. Places, people, places. I'm gonna need somebody to get rid of that train. Go, go. Here we go. Oh, fucking cool. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine, I don't care. Bro, all right, let's do it again. <laughs> Check it out. You. You. <laughs> oh, good shit. Nice. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Uh, Don't move. We got the law. He said some hooligans were playing with fire by the water. <laughs> Jump in the water. <laughs> oh shit, he doesn't see us. He doesn't see us. He doesn't see and he stops. He sees us. He definitely sees us. If we just don't move, <laughs> he won't see us. Oh, he's leaving. Uh I think we're good. No, mm, it's my turn. I gotta look cool. It's my once. My one shot, bro. It's gonna get all the ladies to slide into my DMs. That's the goal, right? That's the goal. This is all for DMs. <laughs> all 
All right. That was, that was pretty. That was uh, fun. That was really cool. <laughs> I never did that before. Awesome. That worked out almost perfectly, except yeah. the photos were blurry. We're not professionals. Uh, but for a first time go, I think that was perfect. I mean, not perfect, but almost perfect. Not truly perfect, but like slightly perfect. Like slightly blurry, not like too bad. Not perfect either. And it doesn't take much to do at all. The only big thing is the camera. You just need a camera with adjustable shutter. Other than that, you just need a whisk, steel wool, a dog leash, and a butane lighter just so that it's windproof against the wind, right? There you go. That's All right. It. Well, if you found that helpful or somewhat entertaining, hit like and subscribe because I'm going to make more videos soon. And comment if you want. Peace.